guys. Well, um, I actually have learned that I really like using my iPhone during my mornings um, when I'm recording and stuff because usually what I'm doing with my camera, my Fujifilm camera, is letting it um, upload all the video from yesterday onto my computer. And so what I like to do is go ahead and use my iPhone for it, which is not really all that bad. It's pretty nice. Um, the other thing too is I brought my desk out of the living room and brought it into my bedroom so that I can start working a little bit more um, in a quieter area because the kids do come in and out, they run around, and it makes it really hard to listen and concentrate on what I'm editing. So I've decided to go ahead and do that. So that was a quick move. Um, it wasn't anything that was like, you know, going to take forever or whatever. So that's what I did today. Um, but other than that, we are going to be getting our day started as soon as I've got the video uploaded and uh, whatnot. So editing this morning instead of doing it like I normally do in the evening. So, all right, guys, we will catch you all here in a little while. Hey, guys. Okay, so I've got the video converting and getting ready to upload took forever but anyway I got my room redone because I did my computer in here because um, I have my other computer which is like my it's like a little notebook and it was like it doesn't have the best like speed and stuff on it anymore so yeah but anyway I got to clean up out here because the kids had themselves a little party time or whatever you want to call it while they were out here earlier so we got to get all of this mess cleaned up because they were hanging out. So we put Luna's kennel there. Um, Dobby's kennel is going to stay in Taylor's room just because he seems to really like sleeping in there with Taylor. So, yeah, so not much going on. We're all trying to really stay indoors today because we all got really a lot of sun yesterday. Um, Taylor ended up really burnt. So he's got a lot of sun burning on him. Um, and then again, he's 15 and we re repeatedly told him, Taylor, more sunscreen, you need more sunscreen. And he was, I'm fine, I'm fine, Mom, I'll be okay. And he paid the consequences for that last night. So as hard of a lesson as it is to learn, sometimes you just have to let them do things that you wouldn't particularly like them to do, such as getting a sunburn like that. Um, it's pretty bad. And uh, I think next time he'll remember when Mom says, put sunscreen on, it's for his own good. But, you know, 15... 15 and a half now so anyway so not really much gonna happen today we're just gonna get this uploaded and I may get them out there to help me clean up well I will get them out there to help me clean up so okay guys um, thanks for for hanging in there it's just like I said it's gonna be a really slow kind of day just because we're trying to stay indoors so um, but yeah Okay guys, so anyway, got all my stuff done, video for the day is uploaded, we are chilling back, um, Taylor's actually going to go put the rent out in the mailbox, and I am going to figure out what I'm going to make for dinner, because I honestly just don't know what I want to make yet. Um, but other than that, not really anything going on today. Sarah's going to go outside and swim in a little bit, she wants to go play out in the sun, out in the swimming pool. That child... She's a glutton for punishment, let me tell you. Though she really isn't burnt, so I really don't have to worry about her too much. Myself, I'm not as burnt as I thought I was. Um, not bad at all. Sarah's really not burned at all. She's just dark. She's just dark-skinned. Um, she kind of got the luckier side of things when it came to her skin color. She got a lot of the Indian in her. Um, other than that, not really much happening today. Um, we went ahead and removed a couple things from my room, put the desk in my room, took out the other type stand that I had in here. We gave that to Sarah so that way she can have her TV and her Xbox and stuff on it. Okay guys, hey, how's it going? So I am actually going to go out here with Sarah for a little bit and we are going to play around in the pool because the sun has finally gone onto the other side of the boat, which leaves us with the pool in the shade. So that's what we're going to do. So that way we're not going to be exposed to too much sunlight because it just gets way too, you know, way too much with us all having been in the sun for a couple of days already. So, yep, I'm going to uh, put this down for a minute so that I can put everything down on the bench and then we are going to get in the water. Okay, so here's Sarah and I out here in the pool. She's going to do some more snorkel practice because uh, she was having it rough yesterday at the river. Um... Because she kept on wanting to dive under, which of course kept filling up her snorkel with water. But she's learning. She's getting better at it. 
but yeah, like she does that and she realizes she can't breathe. You goofy. I know, I know what I'm doing. Sure. She's brought rocks in my pool, which is not a good idea because rocks I in the swimming it. pool. No, because it can tear the pool. You're gonna have to tear in the swimming pool with all those. Anyway, she's down here. It's my office. Okay, so I probably have a mark on my face from my mask, and my hair is probably all see. funky. Yeah. Oops, there goes your snorkel. No! Uh, that snorkel! Sarah's having fun over here with that. I'm just swimming around in the pool, just snorkeling, finding all the yucky stuff that I can get out of the pool. Uh, so, anyway, yeah, that, that's what we're doing right now. So here we go. Uh, anyways, yeah, so it's nice to be able to come in here and just relax a little bit for the end of the day, but we're going to go inside and watch the Lego movie in a little bit. It's a little yucky out here. Hold on, let me upload these pictures to my okay. computer. She's playing like she's at an office on a computer thing. Yeah. Okay, done. You wish it's great when you have a 13 year old who still has very. You wish it was that easy. <laughs> it's great when you have a 13 year old who has like a great like creative mind. She's always thinking, creating, and Wiggly. imagining. So it's a good thing. It's really good. What's really good? Having a little person like you who's very creative and who's <laughs> always thinking of creative, imaginative things to do. Exactly. Uh, ew. <laughs> Yeah, there's a wall there. <laughs> Overpowered. So anyway, I think I'm gonna get out just because I'm a little bit chilly and no! my sunburn actually does hurt a little bit from being in the water, so I think I'm gonna get out and no. let Sarah play a little bit longer. Because Sarah can play for a little while. I even brought her a towel out. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get out, um, I'm going to go in and get dinner started, and then set up the movie for tonight, so that way they can watch the Lego movie, because that's the one we want to watch tonight. So that's my baby. Yep, her's the Petey girl, even with goggles on, she's Petey. <laughs> Alright guys, we'll see you all in a little while. Hey guys, okay, so I'm out of the pool now. I had to brush my hair, it was like all tangled up. But um, I'm making like a like a barbecued type fish tonight. It's gonna be like a sweet, spicy, kind of Cajun styled fish. Um, and I'm making a a rice and then um, corn and green beans because my kids are kind of 
either or. My son does not like corn. My daughter does. So Sarah will be eating probably corn and green beans, but Taylor will probably only eat the green beans with it. Um, I'm still trying to figure something out. I'm over here. I turned on the TV when I came in. And on Animal Planet, they have this thing about tree houses, like these tree house builders. But what I can't understand is what does tree houses have to do with animals? Because Animal Planet is supposed to be about animals. So I don't know. But, yeah, so that's my kind of what the heck thing for the day. But oh well. So, yeah, I am kicking back. Already did the video. I've got footage i got to edit. Dinner's cooking. It's in the oven. And I'm just going to chill for a little while. Sarah's still playing in the water. And Taylor is finally getting to use his new tablet because we were able to finally get it charged. So, kids will be kids. Teenagers will be teenagers. So... Alrighty guys. Okay, so dinner's ready. We are eating some like barbecued fish with some green beans and veggies, you know, corn and noodles. Sarah's eating it too. Yummy. Taylor decided to sit over there because he's watching the the Carbonaro effect. Which actually is a pretty good show. If you ever get a chance, watch it. It's really cool. <laughs> so alright, um if anybody's curious, these noodles here that we make it's from using um, ramen noodle. You take the ramen noodle and you just cook just the noodles. Separate your sauce packet. When you're all done boiling the noodles up and getting them nice and soft, strain your noodles. And then in the pan that you've strained the noodles out of, use that pan. Put like, for per packet, I'd say use a tablespoon of butter or margarine, whichever one's your favorite. We like margarine better. And then throw in the seasoning packet with the butter and get, get it nice and melted up and mixed together, then throw your noodles in with that and fry them up together. And you get the noodles like that, so they're really, really good. All right, guys, we will uh, talk to y'all later. <laughs> okay, Sarah's got the puppies playing. <laughs> Luna, for some reason, has a thing about boxes, which is really funny. Watch out for the computer. Are you boxing the box? Get it, Luna, get it. Get it. Get it, big girl. <laughs> Watch out for the computer, sir. <laughs> she likes boxes. Yep. <laughs> She's so cute. Dobby's like, what is she doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, where to go? <laughs> she just slides it across the ground. Bobby's just walking around like, I don't know what is she, what they are doing, but... <laughs> Where are you going with it? <sighs> Sarah's too funny with her. Alrighty. Luna, you say bye-bye. Dobby, say bye-bye. Tonkers, say bye-bye. Aww. Yep, Luna says, I'm going to box until I'm done. <laughs> oh, God, that one. <laughs> <laughs> she just stayed there. Get it, Luna. Get it, baby. All right, bye-bye, Luna. Bye-bye, pretty girl. <laughs> so this is... um. <laughs> Luna's uh, time for play. She's decided that she's going to exhaust herself with a box. And that's okay. It's fun for them to do this. We get lots of boxes every month, so. Hey, Sarah. Until Hi. everybody see you, see you later. I know, right? Well, we're getting ready to watch the Lego movie. 
So we are going to go ahead and uh, call it a night. Um, Taylor's over here playing around on his tablet. Time to put that up, big guy. It's time to watch the movie. All right, so we will um, we'll see you guys tomorrow. And uh, we hope that everybody's had a great day, evening, afternoon, night, wherever you may be. And uh, we'll talk at you all later, all right? If you like the videos, give it a thumbs up. And hit that subscribe button. And thanks again for watching. Bye.